happy that you are watching the Paula Show tonight. It's about diabetes and living with disabilities. So we have with us here Mr. Lenroy Lumber Hazelwood and Mr. Christfield Bull Hazelwood. <laughs> this young man, my darlings, such a beautiful name. Christfield, I could easily call him Chris, but he wants me to call him Bull? I am not doing that on the call <laughs> Ladies, you prefer Chris, right? Yes. yes. You prefer Bull, right? Yeah, that's Bull is supposed to be. Yeah. <laughs> you picture me while he is me together. <laughs> and you call him Bull? A Bull is supposed to be. Yeah, Tonight, so let's say Chris. If you be Chris tonight, we left and you out there. Okay, Lenroy Lumber Hazelwood, behave yourself on the parlor show. You're originally from Seaton's, but you're now living in Old Road. Why are you living in Old Road? Ladies, can we get So when you were living in Seaton's, and your lady was living in Old Road, you drove a car? No. How did you get to Old Road? Big way, no work. <laughs> Walk from yeah. Seaton to Walk Old Road? We can bus, on, bus leave me for a while ago and be going again. <laughs> Seaton to Old Road. Any of you guys who do that? Mm -hmm. For love? Yes. <laughs> gentlemen like you and nobody? Are you trying to find someone? But why do you think you're not successful? Maybe you're not trying hard enough. Listen, there are lots of ladies who would, they would love you. Yes, even with your disability, they would love you. But if you are not willing to be friendly, then nobody is going to befriend you. It's a biblical principle. Okay? So you have to try harder. All right. Now, you both grew up in Seaton's, mother and father. Ten children, eleven children in the household. What are the values you learned from your father? Because you told me he was the first farmer of the year in Antigua and Barbuda. He raised up doing farming. He raised up in a hard work. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's why the reason why we still work. Because the father, the father, father yeah, that is, that is, you know, me, uh, my father just put me there. Mm -hmm. uh, he set me up and made me be what me be. With the help of the father of me. So when you were doing this farming, yeah. you had both legs? Yeah. And you had both yeah. legs? Mm -hmm. Okay. Lumber. You learned quite a lot from your father. Yes, ma'am. And while you were learning at your father's feet, you had both legs. Yes. You had both legs yeah. as well. So when you said you had to do farming, I mean lots of acres? Yeah, yeah, the two grounds. Or the backyard garden? No, no, no. no. Real, <laughs> real farming. Real farming. Yeah. yeah. And a play place. So. <laughs> uh -huh. And not That's easy to. I don't want play place. <laughs> Can't say that you no, offend the true. farmers. No, it's true, no, true. true. So whatever he says, you agree? No, what watch out. When when it's a farming nowadays, right? Then farming a farmer a spray the ground. Before time, no. Weed. We have to use hope and weed. In this age of technology, you expect people to be still weeding and hoeing farming. And farming. farming. Yeah. <laughs> So in your backyard gardening, yeah. at your house, yeah. you still weed and hoe and yeah. fork? Yeah, me we hoe and use pick. We well, use the fork now, we use pick. Mm. And dig up the earth. They will turn up the earth to where it's left. So you, the, the, the sun you can come. The valley, the, um, so farming back then is different than farming now? By far. By far. But what are the values you learned from your father, apart from farming, and he was the first farmer yeah, yeah. of the year? Hard work. 
Hey, well, for the truth, I'm a strict man. Very strict, yeah. Yeah, nice man when he come from like. He's still alive? No, he died. Mother died? Yeah. So he was nice when he came to what? Like, um, certain things, like a home thing. But when he come from like. Well, first, well, well, first, no, um, free growing and okay, so serious thing. He was very uh -huh. particular about his family. Uh -huh. So you guys used to be punished. Uh, yeah, hey. Don't you're, go there. You call that a punish. What do you call it? Abuse. <laughs> well, okay, some people will say that, but me, you say, thank God for that, yeah. because if he do that, me, me the jail for today. Yeah. Yeah, mm. because. Obviously, no, um, like, okay, um, if you do something wrong, mm -hmm. you're not bang with that, you know. Why? Like, in the old days, they say anything come to the hand. <laughs> so what would you use, like, packing? Packing, uh, okay, packing nice, yeah. You ever get, um, <laughs> when sun hat, and you see the hose, garden hose? Yeah. If you get toward that. <laughs> oh, my God! Mm -hmm. right. You guys don't do that to your children. Me a scarf and hose. Me get the government back and ask her. Oh, I find that. But okay, people say, oh, this and that. Right? But, 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 but for serious that, thing, that's a bit much. That doesn't make me feel good for today. Well, me not go tap say so. Even with the scarf. With the scarf, yeah, show you what to do. Yeah, this will be a lot of harder. So that was when he was really upset. Because sometimes we, we just have a lot of sheep and go. We have over 200 sheep and go together. And we have to feed them out. Mm. Feed them out of mind before I go to school. Feed them out of the So, as we But without all that hard work, why would he still beat you? Mm. Yeah, sometimes, you know, do what he said we do. I uh, just stop and come. He just stop and go play football. Let the sheep play <laughs> and, and I play football and, and I would walk. Feed the pig and so. Uh, yeah, so, uh, so uh, this sounds like old MacDonald had a farm. Like a real, real farm. Where does that come from? Maybe over 50 something pigs. No? No, no any no, days, any days. Any and you guys had to feed them? Yeah, yeah. I have to go in the pen and clean pigs. Clean them, then they the mess out of the pen. Shovel them out. Wash out the pen. No. No, 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 no. Hey. Uh, you. Uh, you. Have you ever smelled pig? So, I hey, you. <laughs> 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 oh. That's not abuse, that not make me so good today. Okay. I bless you, not fall for me right now. <laughs> so sheep, you know. goat, goats, pig, pig pigs, donkey, donkey, rabbit, <laughs> rabbit, rabbit anything chicken. Well, good. I want to look at how far. Oh, I want to look at how far. Your father had diabetes and yeah. your mother as well. Yeah. Yeah. My mother died early, died when we were about 11 or 12. 12. Really? Mm. Yeah. Well, my sister and, him, and them who took care of you guys. Yeah. Mm. And you have an older brother who had diabetes and died. Yeah. Yeah. He take it on, and he lose the feet, and yeah. maybe he has scanners. I'm the first with diabetes now. Mm. Out of the fact of something, I'm the first one now. We lose two to already or something. Mm. I know all yeah. that. Yeah. But, but the other children, there are 11 of you, mm. only three. No. no. There are uh, others with diabetes. Two, yeah. two, yeah. More, two, two more, two more. So the entire family basically yeah. has diabetes. Yeah, yeah, we see that. Maybe if I do rest in an hour for the time, yeah, but it may work either. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> well, me, pray, me pray that you're working. You tell the truth. I am praying it doesn't yeah, work. It doesn't work True, true. Because you don't want everybody Hey, uh, to be uh, 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 no. I'm the first with diabetes, no. the second to last. No. Uh, I'm the first out of the mother and father no. kid with diabetes. No. Uh, and you look like I have diabetes. <laughs> I don't want to answer that no. question. I nurse, Everybody I don't think you can look at somebody and say you have diabetes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 yes. There's yes. certain characteristics, but look at me. Do I look like I have diabetes? And I could have diabetes, Yeah, right? but so, certain things you can, you can see and sign. Okay, listen. I want to hear all about the amputations and everything. So we're going to return and speak about those toes 
and the shin that was amputated and the ankle that was amputated. Mm. And um, mm. they're going to be coming back. That's a lot of amputation. It starts mm -hmm. to make me feel as if I have to take better care of myself and do better. not want diabetes. Any of you want diabetes? Oh. It's a serious disease. Stay with mm -hmm. us on the Paula Show. We'll be right back.